Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for our daily guidance angel message. And this is timeless, so whenever you receive the message is when you are meant to hear it. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers, the highest good of all. And it says, opportunity to forgive. This situation brings you the opportunity to heal, grow, and release negative patterns. Hold the intention of seeing the other person's inner divine light and goodness. We will help you release unforgiving thoughts, feelings, and energies and lift you to a higher place of peace and compassion. Okay, now, you have been watching my videos for quite a while, most of you out there, and you know my stance on forgiveness, okay? You can forgive someone, but it does not mean that you need to allow them back into your life, especially... If someone apologizes to you, but their behavior hasn't changed, okay? I have a problem with forgiveness when the person apologizes, but you know they haven't changed in any way. And by having them come back into your life is just going to be ending up in the same toxic cycle that you just got out of. Every situation is different. Use your discernment. My feelings about the word forgiveness, I'd rather replace the word forgiveness with acceptance, but that's just my, my take on it. You guys do what you want, you know, whatever's best for you, whatever works for you. When I accept things as they are, it doesn't mean that what they did was right. Just like when you forgive someone, it does not mean that what they did was right or okay by any means. When you forgive someone, it means that you're no longer going to harbor feelings of anger and resentment towards that person that are going to constantly be in your mind holding you hostage to this terrible situation, okay? That's what they mean by forgiveness, you know, that you let that go. To me, I'd rather use the word acceptance because honestly, there are certain things in this world that I can't forgive, okay? And I'm being honest, okay? I'm not holier than thou. I'll forgive everybody. It's your only way you could get to heaven. God wants you to forgive. Yes, on a, you know... How could I say it? On a case-by-case -case basis, okay? Not everyone deserves the forgiveness of a loving heart if they've intentionally done things that were maliciously wrong to destroy someone. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'd rather use the word acceptance where I accept what they did, which doesn't mean I feel it's okay or right. It's just that now I don't, you know, feel anything. I'm not feeling hatred. I'm not feeling anger. I'm not feeling resentment. I'm accepting it and moving on. That, that's how I move on. Some people rather use the word forgiveness, where they truly do find it in their heart to forgive someone. And that's fine. And again, to me, it's on a case-by-case -case basis. There are people that I do forgive. I forgive myself for a lot of things that I've done too. Uh, but it's up to you. But this comes to us to let us know that, you know, there's maybe someone in your life that you need to forgive or you need to accept what has happened and move on from it. But again, it doesn't mean you allow them back into your world. Interesting card for today. If you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up, share it, and above all, subscribe because I will be back with more.